Hello everyone, my name is Mellow Soup, and welcome back to another YouTube video. Today, I'm going to be playing Animal Crossing New Horizons and fixing up one of a villager's vacation homes in Happy Home Paradise. So, see you in just a few seconds. Now, how do I turn this camera off? Oh, wait, wait, I think I got it. Okay, there we go. Okay, so you know, I've got an idea in mind. I'm hoping that it'll work. I'm thinking... I don't really have thoughts right now, but the one thought I do have is partition wall, accent wall, pillars, bed. You'll get what I mean when I put it in action, but yeah. Yes, I want to work. Give me the work, pink manatee woman. Ultimate beauty salon. That's an idea. It's a hot tub. I, hot tubs are great. I've never been in one, but they sound good. You you come here all the time. Can you just leave? Nobody's ever going to give you your cream room. Because I'm the only one here. Okay. Vegetables. I could give you a vegetable garden. Okay. No. Ugh. My favorite power couple, how are you doing? Okay, Lyman. Um, you... I don't know what you said. I don't really care. You said something about veggies. So, I'm gonna give you a vegetable garden. Okay, this is like a flat, open area. Like, not completely flat, it's still got trees. But I feel like this would be the perfect spot for you. Okay, we've got a big farming floor plan to work with, so let's get everything set up. There we go. An entirely fenced-in area except for the front. That's perfect. And now we just need pathing. Let's get something worked out. Okay, that's nice and cute. Okay, copy. Let's just add some carrot plots right there. And then pumpkin and tomato. Pumpkin will go over here. I want it to have... Let's see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Picnic blanket. Just a nice little picnic blanket with the nice edges. Now let's go get some things from the furniture. We s you know, we know you love chips, so let's give you some chips over here. We know you love veggies, so a veggie sandwich set. A fancy tea set. Oh wait a second, I should customize the house. Yeah, that works. Let's give you... Is there the hay? Yes, thatch roof. Nice. And for siding, that looks good. And nice maple wooden door. That is such a cute house. Okay, the outside is finished, so now I just need to work on the inside. Oh. I see we had a very different vision. Lyman, I think we're gonna need to get- let me have- I think you're gonna need to let me have some creative liberties, okay? Or else. Oh! 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 Okay. Fine, I'll listen to what you say. Goodness gracious. You know what? Just because I said we had to have fencing doesn't mean that we don't have to hide things behind his house. So, let's get that done. Now, what do you want that I don't want you to have? Guess it's only really the salad bar. Okay, there. Now, the salad bar is hidden behind your house, so we don't even have to worry about it. This is perfect! Now I don't have to listen to your plans. Your evil, evil plans. Okay, now you listen to me. Do not tell Lottie about this or I will be fired. Look, here's- I'll Venmo you $500. Okay, we're good. I want you to have, like, a cozy, country-style home. This is a perfect bed. Now, I just need to figure out your kitchen. Which I think will be difficult, but I can figure it out. 
Okay. That's looking great. Now we just need to turn it into a kitchen. Ranch kitchen. Nice. Let's move you over here. We customize this so that it is... Let's just make it white. Yes, that looks very nice. I think we could use an island right now. Some tall island counters. And I don't want it to be up to the window, so I'll just put it, like, right near the window. And duplicate it one more time. I think this counter would be even more perfect. Like that. Ooh. Ah. It's perfect. These wooden stools work perfectly. So I'm just gonna keep duplicating them. There we go. Nice. Rugs. Let's add rugs to the kitchen. The medium black mat. That's nice. So that way we can partition this off so that the bedroom is its own separate room. And add this right here. Yes, this is working quite well. Although I f feel like you need a carpet in here. Okay, that is a nice... That's very nice. Okay. A table lamp? A table lamp! Okay. And the person in the m on the left isn't that hungry, so they're just gonna have an iced... An iced latte. Oh, I've got an idea. Let's do this. Oh. Oh. Now that, that is a good addition. I like that. Sofa. I feel like this is a very nice vibe that it's got going on here right now. I feel like they would benefit from the Imperial decorated shelves. I use them everywhere, but they're absolutely exquisite. His kids probably sleep with sleep with him when he gets them. So let's just add some little stars. Let's add a photo of his love interest on the wall because you know he misses her w because she's gone off to serve in the military. Wait, creatures? Goldfish? Okay. They definitely have a goldfish. I'll just put little Little goldfish John right here. This is to signify who is here. They just have like... This wooden chest right here that is for all their clothes. A veggie basket. Since, you know, he has to go out farming and he just leaves his veggies in there. Well, he is waiting for the people to come and pick them up, since I totally know how farming works, and that's definitely how it works. Let's take a tour. Okay, this is Lyman, a father, because his wife, Alice, is out on military duty. He keeps a photo of her up above the door at all times. Um, this is their... A collection of books that they read from all the time. And then over here they've got a little cup of coffee. Uh, the little girl Lyman has just loves iced lattes. If we go over to his, his bedroom that he shares with his children, they all manage to fit in this bed. And the little veggie basket where he keeps his veggies before he sends them off to the farmer's market because i know how farming works and that's definitely how it works then down here we have their little lights to say who's home the white ones alice's then lyman's then jason's and then the other one and then we've got his little watering can that he's had since he was a little boy that's the entire place let's watch let's watch whatever they do with it here Let's see what the game pans with. Okay. Variety of Veggies by Lyman and Noah. Nice upwards panning. Mm-hmm. 
Ah. Yes, the cubes. The cubes of destiny. Ooh, ha, ha, ha. Beep, 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 beep. Wow, wow. Very long. Let's go with Hotel Man. Here's what I'm thinking. Gestures of a hotel. Oh. That is not the bed. Now, I feel like every hotel that I've been to has always been a tr in a tropical place. Okay, this is- that is actually, like, the layout of a hotel that I've been to. So, let's just go there. Let's get everything worked out. Now let's add a little parking lot. Okay, how can I customize this? Okay, white. That's perfect. Custom design. Yes, I'm so glad I can put a custom design on it. Now, I'm almost sure that I'm going to overwrite this design eventually, but I don't really care. I do not like that bathtub at all, so we're not going to use it. And you might be thinking, oh, Noah! Are you going to get past him without using that bathtub in the house? Well, here's the thing, my dear viewer. Since we can't put it behind the house, it's going to be a car. Ladies and gentlemen, your car awaits you. <laughs> and don't worry, the Indigo Disc, like, second episode will still be out next week. I just wanted to get this out because... I love Animal Crossing, and I couldn't go another day without making an Animal Crossing video. Okay, you know what? Uh, you're just going to have to roll over to get in bed, maybe? There's no door on the bathtub, on the bathroom, because we're just that cheap. Toilet and bathtub. Now, if there's one thing in hotels are notorious for, even though we always say we don't want it, is carpet. Carpeted bathroom. Here we go, TV. 50 inch TV. It's pretty good. I like it. Now let's see, what shows are on at this hour? Ah, such wonderful TV. Still images with indistinguishable speak. Oh, news. He brought a laptop and a tablet device so that he can work his 9-to-5 op office job. And, and of course, he's on Zoom. Or whatever, because that's where everybody was during lockdown. <laughs> I, I didn't know that they had this. Oh my god, this is so cute. It's literally just zoom. Let me zoom in. Oh my god. They've got dogs. It's That's so cool. I honestly think this is pretty good. I'm gonna give you... I'm gonna give everyone a tour. This is Zell. He is a deer. He wanted a hotel room. So over here we have the chair that always squeaks whenever you sit down in it and since he is in lockdown he can't leave the hotel room which means that he's stuck uh, on this doing zoom meetings with his friends and talking to michael while he's doing the zoom meeting because he's just a little bit too lazy now going over to the bathroom we have Toilet. And over here, we have the bathtub. That is a bathtub. For some reason, he wouldn't let me have a normal looking bed, so we had to add this. And over here, we have the TV. That the remote for has been lost somewhere behind this desk cabinet thing. But the maid that comes up here every two hours will not look for it. Why did I say two hours? I don't know. But 
Now it's canon. Okay, Zell, let's let's see what the panorama thinks. Animal Crossing. Let's see what you do with it. Come on. Okay, that actually looks pretty, so I'm gonna take a photo of it. Oh, the toilet. Oh my. The Zoom meeting with the rotating... And... Oh, he turned on the TV. He's mesmerized. Hello, I'm Zell. Hello, everybody. My name is Mellow Soup, and, uh... In the middle of editing this, something bad happens, and yeah, I am not happy with it. My rat Wonka died. You know, the one that was featured in a video recently, the introduction video I made. She's dead, and that made me really sad. Which means now I'm going to find the villager on my island that looks exactly like her and build her a vacation home in her honor. So, yeah, let's get into that. And I'm going to turn the camera off once more. Goodbye. <laughs> there you are. I'm giving you a dream. Oh my gosh, it's souvenir chocolates! You're totally the sweetest! Thanks, Noah. So there's like this rumor floating around that you work at an island resort. Is that really true? It is. Let's go right now. I want to build you the most stunning vacation house, my darling. You're welcome. Yes, work me. Oh, don't let me have to make a hospital. No, I don't want to create a hospital right now. I'm just going to give up. Okay? I don't want to make a hospital. We're done. We're done. Hey, finally. Goodbye. You're a horrible boss. I'll be telling Tom Nook on you. Okay, that's perfect. We're giving you a big two-level home. Oh, it looks perfect. Okay. Let's get into it. First of all, let's open that box. Perfect. This looks even more perfect. It's probably got a window in the back that we can't see because I said so. We want it to be black, and we want nice gray siding, and a white and black zen door, with, well, snowflakes come from the sky, so a snowflake reef, crescent moon chair, because we all know that's, like, the best chair in the game. There we go. That is much more Blanca. I know it's not a rat. But it's the best we can get. Let's just add it, like, right here. J no, just right there. So the exterior is finished. Looks absolutely adorable. Oh, and, this, and the yellow star rug is perfect. Let's make it... 8 by 10. This cool sofa. We'll get a 20-inch LCD TV. And we'll put it right there on the coffee table. Okay, I know she likes froggy chairs. So, let's just add in an interdimensional space froggy chair. So I feel like she'll like the wooden block chairs. Let's get a kitchen worked out. Here we go, let's get the kitchen stove. A utility sink with a kitchen counter. And they need an ingredients cabinet, so... I know I might have not added these for everyone else. I just care more about this villager than everyone else. 
I feel like that works. And, ooh, we can add stew in there. Curry, chili. Well, chili. <laughs> Okay, the, the nursery reminds me of the bedding she used to have in her cage. Okay, of course, pastel. Oh, can I customize that to be red? Okay, please have a... Hamster cage! That's exactly what her cage used to look like. Before, you know, she passed. Blue bottom on top of my red dresser. Yeah, this is pretty accurate. And I feel like this puppy plushie works so well. We have a dog named Pluto. I'll put an image of him up on screen. But he used to come in here all the time. And until we stopped him, he would just bark at them. <laughs> Being like... Well, he wouldn't bark all the time. Sometimes he'd just like look at them and then look at us and then look at them and then look at us and be like... Please... I want to hang out with them and definitely not eat them. And we would never let him eat them. I think first floor done. And I won't do much on the second floor since I already did so much on the first floor. I wasn't planning to anyway on the second floor. I was mostly planning to have it be like an observatory type place. Of course we're gonna have the have it looking out the window. I wanna move it a little to the left because it, I felt like it was looking just right into the thing. You know what I mean. Yes, that that is perfect. The snowflake wall. Let's add the Moroccan tray table with the, with the rocket. I cannot add the rocket. The rocket is much bigger than I thought it would be. You know what? Let's replace that with the crescent moon chair. Yes, that fits much better. I feel like that is a nice upstairs observatory. So now I will give you a tour. Handheld camera. Turn this off and we're good. This is the living room where Blanca here will come and sit on the yellow sofa with soon to be here Cole and watch the TV and a little froggy chair, which they will pull over to the dining room anytime someone wants to share minestrone soup with them. And then, and then in here is the kitchen, where there is a big stew pot cooking chili, since, since it's my favorite dish, a carrot smoothie being cooked over there, and golden teapot kettle um, cooking tea, and a dresser for their ingredients. A moon rover, because she said she liked the stars and astrology and stuff. And then over here, there is Pepper and Blanca. I'll put in real life pictures on screen now of how they looked like before they passed. And in here is Pluto, my dog. Another picture, in case you forgot him. And... Blanca running on her wheel in her rat cage. Ours was a bit pretty much larger, like a lot larger, but you know, this gets the gist across. And then her bed that she'll share with Cole when she co <laughs> aka Pepper, when she comes, when Cole slash Pepper eventually comes to live here. Which looks like her bedding that she had in her old cage, like this one. That is not- that's grain on the bottom of that one. We would never give her grain bedding anymore. And of course the earth rug and the star fragment rug. Moving on to the upstairs tour. This is the observatory where she will sit on her lovely crescent moon chair and look out of her telescope and watch the stars and her little candle which I will eventually turn around a rocket ship over here and Wonka and Pepper once again that's the picture I want that perfectly gets across the image everything's ready for you Wonka
You spent all this time building this just for me. I am so happy. You did amazing, Noah. Thank you. Thanks so much for today. You're, you're welcome, Blanca. Bye, everyone.